What's up, Slowbro Squad? Today we have a huge update covering Pokemon 151 product releases and some information on some of our future videos and live streams. If you don't want to miss anything in this video, stay to the end. Or don't. It's up to you. Without further ado, let's dive in. First up, Pokemon 151. This set is becoming more and more challenging to find. However, there are some retailers which will still have some in stock. So first up, I'm going to say Smiths. Smiths, I looked on their website. They have some of the two-pack mini tins still available. But there has been some rumours that, that we are getting a restock of the booster bundles coming in from November the 7th. So keep an eye out for that one, as there might be some more products to be restocked, such as like ETBs, they might be coming back, or the poster collections. All right, as for other retailers, like Oregos, I'm not sure if they will have the same stock in store already. However, I do believe that we will still be getting the restock on the 7th. Well, there's been no major reprints of Sword and Shield sets confirmed in the UK. There are some good information across the pond for you guys in the US of A later on in the video. So hold on to your seats. All right, so if you are a Costco member, keep an eye out for the Pokemon 151 mini tins again, as you can get them more in bulk at Costco because sort of what Costco is, you know, buying bulk and that. But they have been doing a really good deal of ETB plus a window tin box plus another box for £79. It did say to keep an eye out for 151, so you might have a chance to get some 151 products in there, but that's not confirmed at all, so you'd have to check from your local Costco. All right, now let's look at the leaks and upcoming card releases from the new sets. Coming in November, and the next big set to watch out for is... Surging Sparks is part of the Japanese Supercharged Breaker set and will mainly focus on electric type Pokemon as well as Terra types. We can expect new and powerful EX and Terra Pokemon that will feature good art and dynamic gameplay changes. Alright, let's go over some of the new Pokemon you can expect to see in this set. Starting up with Pulmot. As part of the Surging Sparks leaks, Pulmot will likely appear as a Hollow Rare or Illustration Rare aligning with the electric theme and its role as a high-speed, high-damage Pokemon, and it's just a, you know, Pikachu clone. Huh? So we can expect to see some new trainer and stadium cards, so there'll be a lot of electric energies with the focus on electric-type Pokemon. Be more like Iron Hands EX, and there are quite a few Pikachus, I'm guessing, because, you know, it's the mascot. We don't make this type of content that often, showcasing future upcoming cards and deals so if you want to see more of these why not drop us a comment down below and maybe subscribe you know helps us out a lot and it's free don't cost you a penny all right now let's get into your deals from america so from the us of a you have probably a mediumly good deal mediumly not a word but deal is you have the new legendary warriors premium collection box it is probably the best price per pack we've seen in a while. You get 14 packs from various Sword and Shield sets and is available in Canada, but sadly there's no word on a UK release. However, be on the lookout for that because some people might start selling them and getting them imported from the USA. So be on the lookout because these contain quite a lot of Sword and Shield packs for quite cheap. All right, now for the information you don't really need. It is spooky month, and as it being spooky month, we've got quite a decent lineup of scary-ish videos for you. Get ready for some spooky fun this Halloween season with our special edition live streams. So, on Halloween night, we'll be doing a scary mystery VR game, plus some pack openings, and maybe some TCG later on in the evening. We'll probably be streaming for a while, so keep tuned for that one. So, we're coming to the end of the video now, but before we wrap up today, we'll be doing some shout-outs. If you want to be in the chance for a shout-out, subscribe, and comment down below your favourite Pokemon. If it's not slow, bro, you won't be entered in. That's a lie, you can put what you want. Alright, first up, we have a good friend and a member of our Discord. Link in description. Is Wazbear's TCG. I'm not going to pronounce that right, because I can't. Simply, I just can. But anyway, you know, somewhere around in this part of the screen, they'll be their channel. Go pay them a visit, please, because they are wicked. And they make their own content, so drop them a sub if you would. Another good YouTuber who I'm going to shout out, who is also a member of my Discord, is Heyday Meow. Make sure to give them a view if you like playing the TCG, because I'm not going to lie, most of my decks are built off of his videos. 
So if you want to show some love and support, give them a follow and subscribe for a chance to be in with our next shout out. Bye.